are the tantalizing controversy that surrounds the enigmatic and perpetually suave Salt Bay. Who would have thought that a sprinkle of salt and a dash of finesse could whip up such a tempest in a teapot? Let's delve into the captivating saga of the man who made seasoning steak an art form and became an accidental internet sensation. Behold the maestro of seasoning, Salt Bayi, also known as Nusret Gokci, a Turkish chef whose flamboyant salting technique took the world by storm. With his slicked back hair, designer sunglasses perched on his head and a knack for theatrics while sprinkling salt as if it were confetti at a New Year's Eve party, Salt Bay carved his way into our hearts and our meme folders. Faster than you can say, pass the salt, please. Oh, the uproar. The world of culinary elitists was shooketh to its core. Is this man a culinary genius or a showboating wizard? They pondered with furrowed brows while sipping on their chamomile tea. Some hailed him as the modern-day Picasso of seasoning, elevating the mundane task of salting a steak into a theatrical masterpiece. Others scoffed, claiming he was more style than substance, questioning his technique and his habit of flaunting his culinary skills like a peacock displaying its feathers. The social media sphere became a battleground. Memes were crafted faster than Salt Bay's salt sprinkling, with his iconic pose replicated by enthusiasts across the globe. The Salt Bay Challenge emerged, where everyone from toddlers to grandparents tried to mimic his salt sprinkling finesse, often resulting in more salt on the floor than on the food. But oh, the controversies didn't stop at the seasoning station. Salt Bay faced criticism for the prices on his menu, prompting cries of, who does he think he is, the Sultan of Salt? Patrons raised eyebrows higher than a well-seasoned souffle at the exorbitant prices, wondering if the added cost came with the side of his signature sprinkling show. Then came the pandemic, and Salt Bay's restaurants found themselves in hot water for allegedly violating COVID-19 protocols. Videos surfaced of lavish parties and flamboyant displays, making folks wonder if he was seasoning his steaks or seasoning the controversy pot. Yet amidst all the chaos and seasoning scandals, Salt Bay remains an enigma, a sprinkle of intrigue in an otherwise bland world. Love him or loathe him, one cannot deny his impact on the culinary world. After all, who else can make tossing salt look as mesmerizing as a Broadway performance? So here's to Salt Bay, the man who taught us that sometimes it's not just about the flavor, it's about the flair. May he continue to sprinkle controversy and seasoning in equal measure, forever keeping us entertained and reaching for our salt shakers with a newfound sense of theatricality. Cheers to you, Salt Bay, for keeping life just a pinch more interesting.